Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Monkey Putter with another course review from PGA Tour 2K21. Now the course I'm going to be playing today is called Kingshire 1712 Remastered. Now there is another one called Kingshire 1712 by the same course designer, which is Midnight underscore Fox 81. But I've gone for this one because it says it's remastered, so I'm assuming this is like a tweaked, updated version. So I've gone for the black tee at 7,428 yards, usual course conditions for a first time playthrough, and the default time of day and weather is morning and overcast. So let's head off to that first tee and we'll get this round underway. Okay, so what have we got here? Opening hole, par four. 422, slight dog leg to the left. Nice opening tee shot. About 120 yards to go. Yeah, not too bad outside chance of a birdie but it's got quite a bit of break on this putt turn oh I over borrowed it or hit it too firm depending on which way you look at it That's a shame. Just a par. It's a tricky par three. It's not a bad effort. Oh, I thought that was in. So close. Third hole is a par five, but this is a tricky tee shot. You've got the two pot bunkers in the middle of the fairway. You've got the stream on the right. Fairway slopes down towards the stream as well. This is going to be a tough drive. It's going to need. Oh, it's gone straight in the bunker. Oh no. Heavy rough. Okay, nothing we can do about that. Just try and get it back on the fairway. And 
This is an awkward one as well. Slightly uphill. I'll nerve hit it fast. Probably a good job I did. That's a good putt. Well, I got my birdie, but I had to work hard for it. This one's uphill, so it's going to be playing a bit longer than the 379 on the card. That's a good shot. Nice tap in birdie. It's a nice setting for a golf course. Quite like the fact that the trees haven't been overused. to the left. One five nine. It's gonna be playing approximately hundred and sixty yards. Swing plane is off, that's gone left. It's a pity. Used to break. It's almost straightened up a bit. I thought it would turn a bit more than that. Now that could be in trouble. Yep. It's gone in the rough. Hit it slightly slow. Just took it offline. This could be good. Go on, keep going. Oh, it just caught a bit of an upslope. No, another misread. Not reading the greens very well at all. 
nice house in the background. Slightly fast. It's not a bad result, though. That's a better part. Tee shot here at the eighth. Try and avoid that rock formation. It looks pretty, but I really don't want to get stuck in there. I've got a feeling that's going to kick to the right. Uh oh, here it goes. Oh dear. Well, it could be worse. I'm not stuck behind the rock, but I am in heavy rough. not too bad and the putt that I've left myself looks pretty straight to be honest so I could really do with the rolling this one in yeah dead straight thankfully So we close out the front nine with a par five. God, that's a long carry over those three bunkers. The wind is behind. Not that there's much of it. Oh dear, that's slightly slow. Oh, it's made the fairway, that's okay. Two hundred and ten yards. Just need to make sure we get over that that water hazard. Needs to sit down. That's pretty good. Chance of an eagle. That's a good eagle. I enjoy the front nine, very pleasant. Let's see what the back nine has in store. A lengthy par three to begin with.
It's a little bounce to the left. Slow down. Not bad. Yeah, it's a good two. A good two to start the back nine with. Looking at the scorecard there, there's only one par five on the back nine. Now, this is tricky. So there's five bunkers on the right hand side, water on the left. Fairway slopes down to the left. Gonna need a good swing. Yep, that is a good swing. Depends on the bounce. Well, that's absolutely fine. Hundred and sixty yards. I misjudged that. I thought it would come around more from the left and it didn't do. I should have aimed it straight at the flag. This is a tricky one. Oh, I overborrowed it. That's a shame. Long par four here. This is going to be including the elevation just over 500 yards. Looking nice. Is it the right distance? That's a good shot. That's a good birdie. I'm really pleased with that one. Par five next. That's a big carry over that bunker. That's a good swing. That should be, yeah, that's well over the bunker. Those two trees just in front of me there are going to cause a bit of a problem. Touch a fade on this. Oh no, that's not a good swing. Could do with a lucky bounce off that bank. Which it's got.
Hold your line, hold your line. Oh, no. Oh, so close. Oh, that's a shame. Eagle would have been nice. Oh, that was a horrible bounce. Straight into the heavy rough. Not sure about the distance on this one. 73 to 80%. About 140. Ah, bad swing. Yeah, it's on the green. Not much else you can say about that one. Oh, I've left myself a horrendous putt. Two putts, please. That's awful. I over borrowed it and over hit it. Just a par. On to the 15th. We've got dog leg to the right. Oh, this is tricky. Got that rockery there. The bunker just beyond it. I'm going to have a go though with the slight breeze behind. I'm just going to try and smash a driver down there. Needs to get lucky. Will it bounce over the bunker? No. Ah, it's a shame. What have we got left? 100 and. That's going to be about 150. Good swing. Needs to go. Just made it. That's a pretty good effort coming out of that bunker from such a long way away. Not a bad effort, but I could really have done with that going in. Long par for this at 16. Nice attention to detail just in front of the T area there. You can see the steps getting down. Oh dear, depending on the bounce, that could be in trouble. No, it's on the fairway, it's all right. Slightly fast, that could be in trouble. It's not too bad. Not very close, but it's on the green. I didn't judge that one very well at all.
Oh, that's a super putt. Just the two holes left to play. Par 3, 17th. That's a nice feature with the, uh, with the wall that you can see going around. And the steps, that's really clever. Very nice. This could be good. Oh, that's a nice shot. Nice birdie. So on to the final hole of the round, number 18. Now that's a tricky drive. It's not an overly long par four, but the fairway gets very narrow and it slopes, slopes down to the left. I wonder if it might be worth laying up here. 428 what I could try is hit a th hit the driver but just take everything off it but it's still going to run downhill that's the only thing it just depends on the bounce I don't I think it's going to go right oh it went left okay That's in pretty good shape. I like that building in the background. That's really clever. This looks quite straight. Not much movement there at all. No, I don't believe it. Oh, what a shame. There was a little bit of break at the end of the putt, and I was hoping it would just hold its line enough to to drop. But unfortunately, because the ball had obviously slowed down at the end of that, it took all the break. Well, that's a really nice course to play. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Can't really find a great deal wrong with that, to be honest. It's, it's certainly got its, its hazards. You've got to think your way around. 100% greens and regulations. Wow, that makes a change. Well, well done to the course designer, Midnight underscore Fox 81. That was really, really nice. Well done. Highly recommend that one. If you've not played it yet, give it a go. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit that like button down below and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I would really appreciate it. So take care, everyone, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.